fellow wood chopperoos. The big chopperoo and safety Dan here. Hey. In the last episode, we showed you how to make this tenon jig. Well, this time we're going to show you how to modify this so you can make raised panels. In fact, the modification is so easy, it's something you just can't live without. New from the amazing makers at Blimo comes the amazing raised panel. It's so amazing, it will amazingly change your life. With the amazing raised panel, you will instantly become the life at any party. Impress your family and friends. Seal the deal and land that new job with this on your resume. Yes, the amazing raised panel will change your life. Don't you think that's a bit of an exaggeration? Uh, no. No, I don't. This small raised panel could be used for a variety of things. It could be a small cabinet door, a drawer front, but in this case, it's the lid to my small box. A close-up of it, you will see that we have the small step and then a predetermined angle to make the slope. And now, without further ado, I give you Ooh. the raised panel jig. Yeah, it's just a scrap piece of plywood. I know, kind of a big build-up for this. But let me show you how it works. Now before I do, let's take a tip from Safety Dan. Oh, hey, always make sure you wear your safety glasses and hearing protection. Um, Safety, I thought we agreed you were going to kind of like change it up a little bit. I did. I said usually say it the other way around. I first want to create that step and what will be the length of the slope. In this case I have it set for an inch and a half and I use my marking gauge. Ooh. With the blade straight I raise it somewhere around an eighth of an inch. I line up the workpiece with the blade and bring my jig over. Then I lock in the fence. I move the jig back and with my miter gauge make the cross cuts. With the saw off, I hold the workpiece to the jig. Carefully remove the jig and bring the fence to my workpiece. Now, I make the rip cut. In three, two, one. Action! Let's do it again! It's time to modify the jig. I begin by removing the sacrificial board and then add my scrap piece of plywood. I'll take the workpiece and clamp it to the plywood. Now this next step is a very important one. You need a zero clearance plate for your table saw. A zero clearance plate has an opening that's just big enough for the blade. This prevents scrap from falling into the saw and avoids harm to you and the table saw. Over the years I've made a lot of these, all at different angles. But the angle I'll be using for this is going to be 15 degrees. Raise the blade up to that kerf cut. Now move the fence over with the workpiece and make the end grain cross cuts first.
Turn the saw off and without moving the fence, flip the board around and make the other cross cut. Repeat and do the same for making the rip cuts. Well there you go, an easy way to modify your tenon jig to make raised panels. Hey, you know Safety, I noticed you haven't had a beer or a cigarette all day. I quit. You quit? Yep. Just like that? Just like that. Cold turkey? Cold turkey. Wow, that's amazing. You know, because we've had a viewer in particular who's been kind of bothered by the whole beer and cigarette thing. Well, I upgraded. You upgraded? Yep. Five-year-old scotch and cigars. Well, if you like what you saw today, subscribe to us on YouTube, where you can give us a thumbs up or leave a comment. And you can join us on Facebook and Twitter or give us a thumbs down. And don't forget about the blog, where we got free plans and merchandise and more. Well, there's one more thing that I got to do. Chad, I think it's time for you to dance. Oh, yeah. This program brought to you by... Application is so simple. Well, it's just something you should... You should... You should... You should... You should... You should... Oh, you're not gonna... I thought you had to do this. No, that's... Okay, well you gotta do Cause, oh, cause you're, oh, cause okay. you're saying your line's backwards. Oh, right. And then... I upgraded. You did? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> to f***ing up again. <laughs> or, give us a thumbs up. Or, give us a thumbs down. And... T -t 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 Twitter and Facebook! Ooh. And don't forget about the blog, where you can read and... <laughs> How do I forget my own lines? I didn't even know. Wait, what'd you forget? I said in the blog, and then I don't know why I... 